to thread your machine, what you're going to do is you're going to pop your spool on so that the, the thread comes from underneath the spool. Pop one of those on and you're going to come along here. You're going to come underneath there, over the top of that there, okay? In around there, down here, up there. And it would be nice if my chair didn't keep squeaking. Down there. And in behind there. Then in behind that one there. Down. Let's thread it. Down there. In behind there. Over there. Pull up. And there we go. There's our thread. Which is the other side of the needle. I want it to come in here because I'm doing it with this hand. Right. There we go. And then you can leave that piece up. To the side there and just group it over there you can actually cut it off from there like that and that keeps that up out the way and that's how you thread your genome you're going to come under here and then underneath this little notch here so you're going to come in behind it look you see so it's behind it there then you're going to go, pull that up, and there's a little loop here at the back, pull on that. And that, I've got a lot of thread here, pull that loop, and there we go, you're threaded. It's very, very easy. Let's do that again, one more time. Push that down, grab this, go underneath that bit there, no, underneath that bit, in front of that what other white notch but then up behind the silver notch up behind that okay so it sort of like rests on can you see it rests on top of that silver notch but it's behind it then i'm going to bring this up and there we go bring brought it through again so you can just feel i can put it that way actually there we go pull that through yeah, thread it again. Okay, all done. So it's very easy to do if you do it correctly. You say it's always got to go underneath, underneath that one, in front of that plastic one there, but then in behind that silver notch there. Then pull up and it pulls it through. Okay, so that's that done.